Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dan Pickett here and I just wanted to take a moment and show you how to do a screen capture. So as a developer, we're often called to capture an image that is representative of something that's showing up on our screen. For example, if we want to talk about a particular feature with a designer or a product manager, we may need to take a screenshot uh, to kind of message uh, them accordingly with this is what I want, I'm trying to do or this is what I'm going for. Basically, adding an image uh, sort of fulfills that uh, cliche of you know an image is worth a thousand words or a, a picture is worth a thousand words, right? So it's a lot easier to talk to somebody creatively when you're building out features when you have an image to uh, be able to talk towards. So our favorite utility for taking screen captures is a tool called Skitch. Uh, and I'm here on a Mac, so uh, you can get this on the App Store, uh, but it's also available on Windows. And it's owned by the wonderful people over at Evernote, uh, and we're big fans of this tool. Uh, so more practically, we've asked you as part of your Learn to Code launch plan to go ahead and take a screenshot of the third page of your worksheet. So I'm just gonna take a moment and demonstrate that using Skitch uh, so that you have uh, clarity on, on how to make that happen. Okay, so here's the launch plan and uh, I filled it out um, and Skitch is already installed and running on my system. So I can use a full screen snapshot which is gonna take the whole image of my entire screen which I don't necessarily want or need um, or I can use my favorite uh, crosshair snapshot which is gonna allow me to select a certain subset of my screen and kind of take a smaller photo. So let's go ahead and do that. We're gonna just do the crosshair and then we will go ahead and pick that up and then capture and then uh, the launch plan is gonna show up here in Skitch and I can kind of annotate things too if I like I can call attention to one particular thing and say this is so important to me right what I love about this tool is it's just quick and dirty it doesn't have to be pretty or anything like that it's just got to communicate what you're going after so some of these annotation tools are really great you can change some of the colors and things like that but mainly I use it as a screen grab tool so uh, once you're ready you can actually take that screen grab and then navigate to the path charters and you can just go ahead and click on this tab here and drag that into the share box and then you'll be ready to share and that's how you do a screenshot with Skitch. Catch you later.